in which he said present-day gymnasts don't work as hard as they used to, seemingly referring to Biles and her teammates Jay Carey, Jordan Chili's, Suniza Lee. You won't believe the drama taking place at the 2024 Olympics. Michaela Skinner just stirred the pot with some shocking comments about Simone Biles and the current state of gymnastics. From cryptic Instagram posts to public apologies, things have gotten intense. How will this explosive situation impact the future of gymnastics? I love our country and don't want to take anything away from our athletes, the 27-year-old captioned an Instagram video on Tuesday, August 6th. In early July, Michaela Skinner stirred up quite the controversy with her blunt critique of the current state of gymnastics. During a YouTube video, she claimed that the work ethic of today's gymnasts, apart from Simone Biles, simply isn't what it used to be. Skinner pointed out that many of the young athletes today don't work as hard and just don't have the work ethic. Her comments didn't stop there. She also suggested that the depth of talent in the sport has declined. This wasn't just a casual observation, it was a bold statement that immediately set the gymnastics community abuzz. Let's use this time to build each other up, not tear others down. Watching people cheer on the bullying is disgusting, she said. Skinner's remarks were compounded by her critique of Safe Sport, an organization established to prevent abuse in sports. She argued that the stringent guidelines imposed by Safe Sport have forced coaches to be overly cautious which she believes hampers the rigorous training necessary for success in gymnastics. Skinner acknowledged that while these precautions are good in some ways, they also prevent coaches from pushing athletes to their limits. Her views drew significant backlash, with many feeling that she was glorifying a harsh coaching style that has led to numerous athletes experiencing trauma and abuse. Simone Biles, always one to advocate for athlete well-being, seemed to respond to Skinner's comments with a cheeky Instagram post. After Team USA clinched gold at the Paris Olympics, Biles shared a photo with her teammates, Suni Lee, Jordan Chilas, Jade Carey, and Hesley Rivera, captioned, lack of talent, lazy Olympic champions. The caption was widely interpreted as a direct response to Skinner's critique, celebrating their hard work and success despite the negative commentary. Michaela Skinner is speaking out following Simone Biles' cheeky message at the Olympics. After Simone seemingly calls out her former teammate's remark, the tension between Skinner and Biles escalated dramatically during the Paris Olympics. Team USA's victory was a monumental moment, with the team bringing home the gold. This win was particularly sweet for Biles, who seemed to use the occasion to subtly clap back at Skinner. Her Instagram post, celebrating the team's success, was filled with a playful jab that didn't go unnoticed by fans. The last thing I wanted was to cause harm or offend our U.S. Olympic team. Fans quickly picked up on the undercurrent of Biles' post. Many interpreted it as a direct response to Skinner's earlier critique, seeing it as a celebration of the team's hard-earned success and a rebuke of the notion that they lacked work ethic or talent. Social media lit up with support for Biles and her teammates, praising their achievements and resilience. To be revisited, but unfortunately things have really gotten out of hand lately and... But the drama didn't end there. Skinner took to social media to address the fallout, expressing that Biles' post had unleashed a wave of hateful comments and cyberbullying directed at her and her family. She made a public plea to Biles, asking her to intervene and call off her followers. This plea only fueled the fire, with Biles responding cryptically and other gymnasts, like Jordan Childs, joining the fray. The exchanges on social media became a spectacle in themselves. Biles's cryptic posts and Chili's pointed comments further inflamed the situation. Fans took sides, with some defending Skinner and others standing firmly with Biles and her teammates. The gymnastics community was divided, and the conversation extended beyond the sport, touching on broader issues of mental health, coaching practices, and the pressures faced by athletes. In the wake of the intense backlash Michaela Skinner faced for her controversial remarks, she issued a public apology, attempting to clarify her intentions. Skinner claimed that her words had been taken out of context and misunderstood. 
She explained that her comments about the work ethic of current gymnasts were not meant to diminish their achievements, but to point out the challenges she perceives in the sport today. According to Skinner, her intention was to highlight the difficulties coaches face under the strict guidelines of safe sport, which she believes can hinder the rigorous training necessary for high-level gymnastics. Skinner admitted that she had not fully processed the emotional and verbal abuse she experienced during her career, which influenced her views on the need for aggressive coaching. She expressed regret for any hurt her words may have caused and emphasized that she respects the hard work and dedication of her fellow gymnasts. Despite this apology, the gymnastics community remained divided. Many felt that Skinner's comments were insensitive and undermined the efforts of athletes who have worked tirelessly to succeed under the current coaching climate. Simone Biles, who has been a vocal advocate for athlete well-being, responded to the situation with a series of cryptic social media posts. Her messages, such as, not everyone needs a mic and a platform, were widely interpreted as directed at Skinner. These posts resonated with many fans and fellow gymnasts, who saw them as a subtle but powerful critique of Skinner's perspective. Jordan Childs, another prominent gymnast, and her mother also weighed in, expressing their disapproval of Skinner's remarks and questioning her decision to publicly air such controversial opinions. This ongoing tension played out on social media, where fans and athletes alike took sides. Skinner's call for Biles to intervene and address the cyberbullying directed at her and her family further complicated the situation. Biles' refusal to directly address Skinner's plea and her continued cryptic posts only added to the drama. The exchanges on social media highlighted the deep divisions within the gymnastics community and the complex issues at play. One of the most significant aspects of the drama between Skinner and Biles is its impact on the broader conversation about mental health and coaching in gymnastics. Simone Biles has long been a champion for mental health awareness in sports. Her decision to withdraw from several events during the Tokyo Olympics to prioritize her mental well-being was a watershed moment that brought the issue to the forefront of public consciousness. Biles has consistently emphasized the importance of mental health, advocating for athletes to take care of themselves and seek support when needed. Biles's advocacy has had a profound effect on the gymnastics community and beyond. Her actions have encouraged many athletes to speak openly about their own struggles with mental health and the pressures of competition. Biles's message is clear. Mental health should be prioritized, and it's okay to step back and focus on well-being, even if it means making difficult decisions like withdrawing from major competitions. This perspective has helped to destigmatize mental health issues in sports and has sparked important conversations about how athletes can be better supported. In contrast, Michaela Skinner's perspective on coaching reflects a more traditional view. Skinner believes that the current safe sport regulations designed to prevent abuse have made coaches overly cautious. She argues that this caution can prevent coaches from being as demanding and intense as she feels is necessary for athletes to achieve their full potential. Skinner's comments suggest that she believes a certain level of toughness and aggressive coaching is required to reach the highest levels of success in gymnastics. While Skinner's views have drawn significant criticism, they also reflect a sentiment shared by some within the sport. There are those who believe that rigorous and demanding coaching is essential for developing elite athletes. This perspective raises important questions about the balance between ensuring athlete safety and maintaining the intensity of training needed for competitive excellence. The drama between Biles and Skinner underscores the ongoing debate within gymnastics and other sports about the balance between rigorous coaching and athlete well-being. Biles' advocacy for mental health has pushed the conversation forward, encouraging a shift towards more supportive and holistic approaches to training. At the same time, Skinner's comments highlight concerns about whether the current emphasis on safety and well-being might come at the expense of competitive performance. Social media platforms like Instagram and Threads have played a huge role in amplifying the drama between Michaela Skinner and Simone Biles. These platforms have become the modern-day arena where athletes can voice their opinions, 
respond to criticism, and engage with fans in real time. When Skinner made her controversial comments about the work ethic of current gymnasts, it didn't take long for the gymnastics community to react. Instagram and threads were buzzing with posts, comments, and reactions, turning what could have been a small controversy into a full-blown public spectacle. The power of these platforms lies in their ability to reach millions of people almost instantly. A single post can spark widespread debate and quickly spread across the globe. For instance, when Biles responded to Skinner's remarks with her cheeky Instagram caption, it wasn't just her immediate followers who saw it. The post was shared, reshared, and discussed across various social media platforms, amplifying its impact and further fueling the drama. Fans and fellow athletes chimed in, either supporting Biles' stance or defending Skinner creating a massive online conversation. However, the same power that allows for widespread engagement also brings significant challenges, particularly the issue of cyberbullying. In the midst of this drama, Skinner found herself at the receiving end of harsh criticism and even personal attacks. The anonymity and distance provided by social media can sometimes encourage people to say things they might not say face to face leading to harmful and toxic interactions. Skinner's plea for Biles to address the cyberbullying directed at her highlighted a critical aspect of social media, the responsibility athletes have in influencing their followers. So, what are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comments below.